c'est bien avant. Voilà, c'est ça. Mais avec un super, au moins, t'as du temps à la vie. So the plane is a is a plane made in China. It's in foam, and the material is quite resist resistant to crashes. Um, it's very common and popular now because they're cheaper than uh, 20 years ago. Uh, to have a model aero model was really expensive. The transmitters were very expensive, but now with uh, manufacturing and uh, electronics have become cheaper and um, yeah we you can afford you can you can have a plane for 150 US dollars or euros uh, including even the transmitter we have here an antenna and a little transmitter for video so we put this GoPro cameras uh, it's a camera that we're going to put here on top and the camera is connected to this transmitter and it will be sending the images and the sound also to a receiver that is here hanging. Uh, we, we, we are aware that the place is might, might not be the best one because of this metallic structure. We should put this higher, but it's okay. Uh, we hope to get some signal, real-time video of the of the flight. Hoping to get it a little bit above uh, San Nazar to get a bit of uh, images of the town from above and. Um, This is with this plane and with this, this is an older plane. It's a, it's a plane where, that I used to learn to fly. So we wanted to play the game of uh, bringing down drones with stones. Um, technically it's not a drone, but it's, a, it's something that you can call UAV, unmanned air vehicle. So this is very common now, it's a technology of war. And uh, they use it for satellite uh, repairing and satellite uh, te technologies of war basically Ant anti satellite technologies can be you can bring up a plane high enough like 300 kilometers above and kick out a satellite or or fix a satellite so these technologies are becoming more popular the north american military they have already tested four of these little planes they look like a, a small uh, navette very similar to the navette the space shuttle um, and they use it for supposedly to repair things but they have cameras and they scan the ground and they do all kinds of things with it so now they're killing people in iraq in afghanistan they're controlling the border so the idea is we should not lose our kind of uh, resistance sp res spirit to resist so for us it's here a game we want to try to hit this with stones you know getting back to the cave age basically We can defend ourselves with stones at least. So it's more a statement, uh, more a speculative statement than a real drone with I can control with my Googles and I don't care about that.